Next, expand the main part of the machine. Align these three lines. Turn on the power. Put in the object to be carved. Touch here for one-click autofocus. Long press here to customize the focus. Confirm whether the light source size is adjusted to the minimum. It must be adjusted to the minimum. Open it on the mobile app. Connect Bluetooth in the upper right corner of the app homepage. Return to the homepage to add a logo. If you need to cut the logo size, you can do it. If you do not need to cut the size, proceed to the next step. If it is a photo of a person, you can choose grayscale engraving, or you can choose direction, mirroring, etc. This step allows you to set the engraving size. This function has a location positioning. Its function is to preview the engraving position. After setting the engraving size, Proceed to the next step. There are some default parameters here. You can customize different powers according to the engraving results. After setting all the parameters, start engraving in the next step. Here we use time-lapse shooting. This size takes about 4 minutes. The time required for engraving varies depending on the size of the logo and the material of the object. Do you think the effect of this carving is very nice?